So here's how to sell digital products on TikTok automatically. I'm going to be using Standstore, and if you want to follow along, you can click the link down below in the description of the pinned comment. They come with the ability to try them for free, so I'll see you on the other side. Let's begin. So Standstore is a link in bio tool, and the main idea here is to be getting traffic to our specific link. Ideally, whenever you make a post, whenever you do any type of video, whenever you talk to someone via DM, you can let them know, hey, I got a new digital product about X, Y, and Z, and I'm going to be showing you how to set up that actual product. It's very quick and easy to do, so let's follow along. On the left here, you can see we're in my store. What you want to do is click on add product. And from here, since we're doing digital products, let's click right here. All right, so here's the great thing. There's only two main steps and one little detail that we need to do. Uh, as I always talk about, I review and tutorial a lot of software tools, and this is probably one of the fastest ways to start selling any type of digital product, just because getting up and running is very quick. I'm gonna explain a few things here, but if I didn't, this can probably take you 10 to 15 minutes, even if this was like the first time you ever doing it. So let's go by each step right here. Pick a style, we have button, Call out and preview. This is literally just going to be preference. I like call out. Down to number two is going to be selecting image. This is 400 by 400 in case you need some help with that. But this is the image that's going to go there. If you have an ebook, if you have a logo, if you have a title, if you don't even have anything, you can use that. Not a huge deal. Now, when we move down, you can see we have our title and it's going to be changed right here. So get my ebook now and you can even be a little bit more descriptive now if it's something say about fitness or nutrition i don't know i'm thinking of that as my first thing could be business it could be recipes that i go back to nutrition again whatever niche or topic it is you can be a little bit more specific and fill that in so if this was for youtube like get my youtube marketing ebook now and so on and so forth now this is actually very important this subtitle it says we will deliver this file right to your inbox i recommend keeping it there or at least having that type of message because what's going to happen is that when they purchase it's going to automatically be sent to their inbox and you want to make sure that your customers know that because if they're unsure about how to get their download you might get a few customer support tickets or questions that could be completely avoided in the first place so definitely something good there get my guide here i like click to continue it is a call to action and it's going to let them know what to do next. And yes, if this is on TikTok, you could also do tap to continue. But ideally, if someone sees tap to continue or click to continue, you're pretty sure they're going to know exactly what to do. So that's the first main step. We have one more. Pretty easy so far, right? All right, now we have our checkout page. So first and foremost is going to be our image. I'm just going to upload one very quickly of my brand that I usually use for this example. Simply click on choose image and the dimensions are 1920 by 1080 in case you need to know that. You can use some if you search for keywords, but I have something specific here. All right, so here's my logo. I'm just going to make it a little bit smaller so it fits better. I think that's fine. Now, normally, if you have an ebook photo, like an ebook cover design, that would be perfect for it there. Maybe a picture of you smiling or anything brand or product related would go right there. I'm just using this because it's my brand. Okay. So this is already auto populated. We did it previously. Get my ebook now. Let's move on to the description. So this blank, whatever you want to fill in right there, I'm going to be doing ebook. We'll teach you everything you need to. And I put X. What's the biggest benefit of your ebook, of your course, of your digital product? So when someone picks it up, they finish it and they actually implement it. What's the big goal that you want to solve? Ideally, that's going to be right here. I want to show you how to grow a growing YouTube business that allows you to generate leads and sales around the clock, even when you're sleeping. Something like that, right? Or achieve a specific amount of followers or build your email list or so on and so forth. Now we have this guide is for you if you're looking to, and these are simply just going to be benefits and bullet points. Okay. What's the juiciest aspects of your ebook? Okay. And that's, you don't need a whole lot here. And I did a video about this previously. I'm going to give you the same example back around in 2012. I won a transformation contest. And this is when I knew nothing about online marketing. Like this is well over a decade ago. And I just randomly put something up giving, and it was a journal documenting about what I did to win. And when I sold it, I just put a PayPal button and said like, you know, this is my journal that showed how I won. There was literally nothing else, but given the fact that I had some popularity because people knew what I was doing and they wanted to see maybe inside my mindset, how I won, how I ate, how I lifted, how I thought, people just purchased and I literally had no sales copy. It was horrible. Like, would that have ever have sold the cold traffic? No. 
But the idea here is if you're on TikTok, you have an audience of people who know, like, and trust you, just putting up something that's very simple and having quite a few benefits can help you get sales, especially if it's a low ticket item like $10 or $7 or $5. Yeah, if it's $1,000, people are going to probably need a little bit more steps in terms of the copy and videos and so on and so forth. But I'm just kind of giving you my advice here. If you're not an expert copywriter, don't worry about it. Get it up and running. You can always make changes later. And on the other side, if you do need more help, Generate with AI is actually very beneficial here. It says, briefly describe your product and what makes it special to your audience. You get 800 characters here, so feel free to use as much as possible. I am just going to give a very quick example to showcase what it's going to look like when it's done generating. All right, so only 137 characters. So once again, the more you put in, the better. This is going to be a little bit more broad, but I want to show you what some of the examples are and how you can edit them. So my ebook shows you how to build a thriving YouTube channel that generates leads and sales around the clock, even while you're sleeping. And another very just quick story there, that transformation contest I won, I got to work with probably one of the best natural bodybuilders in the world. He also worked with Tony Robbins and a lot of great mindset coaches. And he told me something that I have still never forgotten to this day. He said that like, Pretty much if you want to be wealthy, you need to learn how to make money while you sleep. And me writing this is kind of funny because that's kind of what this can do for you. This is going to be automatic. So while you're going to be having posts on TikTok or videos and so on and so forth, the idea is that you always have this content out there and it's going to be directing back to your link. So when someone purchases, they go to inbox and that's how that can actually happen. So a couple things going on there. I just wanted to very quickly explain, brought me back in time a little, and I certainly see the importance of those words. Uh, if that's music to your ears, I hope that affects you as much as it did for me well over a decade ago. So I'm going to click on generate. And give me a moment here when it's done generating, I'll get back to you and, uh, and I'll do some editing fancy work in about a few seconds. All right, and we are ready to rock. So just kind of quickly glancing over, are you ready to learn secrets of this? Why choosing this? So proven strategy, discover what you can do. Keep in mind, it might create some things that aren't gonna be in your ebook. You can just delete them, right? Uh, what you'll learn, like if your chapters aren't laid out like that, that's completely fine. The also good thing about this is that it could give you great ideas that you might wanna add into your ebook. So that's also something to keep in mind, testimonials and so on and so forth, All right? Even if a lot of this is incorrect in terms of how it's laid out, there's still some good quality content you can use. So you can either dismiss it and not use it or replace it. And keep in mind, it will actually replace what you have here. So if you created something long and drawn out, maybe copy and paste it to a notepad in case you maybe wanna try and use it later. So I'm gonna do replace. And just like magic, it does replace, okay? So I didn't put a whole lot of content in there and it still gave me something really good. So uh, like why choose get my ebook now? That's clearly not the name of the ebook, but you know, put in whatever it is, say Marketing Island I'm just, as an example. And a lot of these you can just delete. Like let's just say like this wasn't in here, I'm not even reading it, but you know, you can delete things like that. If you are brand new and you don't have any testimonials yet, it's very cool. Welcome to the world of digital marketing. You can delete that and always add them in later if needed and so on and so forth. So that's a much easier way to get up and running. If you want something more in depth, more content, just make sure that once it's created, it is tailored towards what you are selling. So it's actually identified correctly. Okay. Uh, bottom title, get my guide. Once again, this is an ebook. Yeah. I've done that one. And we can do, I like buy now. I always talk about that. And one last thing here, we have our price. So you can actually use a discount price if needed. So let's say this is $19.99. You can actually have like a strike through where it showcases. And this is just a great psychological thing to actually say, maybe get some more sales. I always talk about if you've ever been to Marshalls or TJ Maxx, I'm in Florida. I used to be in Connecticut. So they're all over the place. But it's like, if you go to Ralph Lauren, this is going to cost you $80. But if you buy this polo here, $14.99 and someone goes, whoa, can you believe how much I'm saving? So it's kind of the same thing here. And my other disclaimer is don't be one of those dumb gurus who says it's normally uh, this much, but for some odd reason, you know, I'm feeling lucky today. All my ducks are in a row and uh, yeah, it's only going to cost you $10 instead of $2,000. Uh, don't do something like that as an example. Okay. So if it is an actual sale, like you can see, like maybe it was 20, now it's 10, but that's something you can use as well. Down to collect info is going to be name and email. These are standard. These are basic. These are required. If you're going to use any other fields, make sure that they are imperative and you will use them because the more fields you add, 
the more hoops someone has to jump through and the higher the chances that they're going to bounce, not purchase, no bueno. Okay. So if you use phone, make sure you're actually going to be, you know, sending them a text message or calling them or whatever it's going to be. But just like that, I think is going to be fine. And this is the last step when it comes to actually uploading and being done with it, aside from payment in integration, which is kind of like the minor detail in the email. So we have upload your digital product. You can upload it, which is very easy to do. I'm going to do that right now. Give me a moment. There's the Marketing Island PDF. And if you wanna make things easy too, you can also go to redirect to URL. If you have a website, upload it there. If you don't have a website, you can go to Dropbox. They have free file storage. So you can upload it, get the link, put it in right there, give it a name. You can also do that on Google Drive. And there's probably a million websites that host tiny files, okay? So the world is your redirect to URL oyster there if you wanna go that route, so to speak. But I'm just gonna be uploading a PDF file. You can download it if needed, you can delete it. But let's simply click on the publish button. Saved, your product is published. Now, if you have anything else in your bio, I recommend putting your ebook towards the top just because it's going to get the most amount of eyeballs. So this is going to be what it looks like on mobile. I like how they have that kind of view there. It looks nice. We will look at desktop later just to kind of give you an idea. But there's two things I want to talk about. Let's click on our ebook now and go back. And I'm going to go to options. Just to kind of show you here, this is going to be the confirmation email, and this is all going to be automatically done. And yes, I did say automatically. So your order from username is here. Hi, customer name. This is auto-populated. Thank you for ordering. Product name, once again, auto-populated. Here's your order. Product file is auto-populated. So if you put in the ebook, they can download it. If you put it a URL, it'll send them to it. If you want to add anything else, you can. It's just about like typing and you know changing things up. But I just wanted to show that to you so you know where it is because that is a very important part. This is how the whole automatic sequence happens. You don't have to send them anything. They purchase, they get an email from you, they go in here and they get what they want. Pretty straightforward, right? So now I want to show you how to hook up the payment, which is very easy. Let's click on settings. And once you are in the settings tab, you want to click on payments. So I already have Stripe here. You can do Stripe or PayPal. And this is very straightforward. If you already have any of these accounts, you would simply click on where it says either add Stripe or add PayPal and you log in with the account that you already have. I don't go into these because one, it's my personal information. And two, it's going to be your personal information, which you know already. So I don't think I need to go through the steps of saying, what's your name? What's this? What's that? You just simply follow the steps and it allows you to integrate within Stan Store so you can actually not only start selling, but making money in the process, which is kind of important, right? Aside from that, let's actually go back and I will show you what it looks like on desktop so I can give you an example. All right. And so once again, if you're on TikTok, you want to put this in your bio and you're pretty much doing whatever you can to let people know about your digital product, whether it be a new post, new videos, DMs, whatever it's going to be, you can always be talking about it. And uh, ideally, this is going to be the desktop version. It's going to look like the mobile version when they're on TikTok, as we saw, but this is going to be their ebook. Let's do click to continue. And here's just an example, everything we talked about. I didn't edit this too much, but I showed you how to do that, only $9.99. And if you go down, this is going to be where they can make a purchase. Keep in mind, if you went ahead and created your ebook and you don't have your payment integration yet, you won't be seeing any of this until you do integrate. So just something I wanted to give you a notice of, but they can enter in their name, email, they can buy now, and it's going to be going through the process exactly as we talked about going through this tutorial. So that is how you can sell digital products on TikTok automatically. I hope you got some value out of this. And maybe if you were just watching to see how the process works and you would like to follow along step by step, you can click the link down below in the description of the pinned comment to try Stan Store for free today. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and enjoy.